it's time for Mr. Fix It, powered by your Chicagoland and Northwest Indiana Chevy dealers. Okay, Lou, we're talking about something I don't know a whole lot about, well, lawn mowers. I was thinking about this. Do you think that Larry, when he's off, he watches the show? Because I know his wife, Lisa, does the lawn. I Wait, what? are you serious? Oh, Lisa does the lawn, and I was thinking he, you know, this would be good for him to know. Right, Paul? Lisa does the lawn. 100% she does the yeah. lawn. He's got his okay. daughter doing the lawn now also. <laughs> right. So I brought a couple uh, that I want to show you. Now, mind you, there's a bunch of different uh, uh, products out there, but I just, I'm showing you two. The first one is Toro, which is probably the quintessential name when it comes to uh, lawn mowers. And this is a traditional gas mower that is self-propelled. It's around $450. Okay. This is a gas-driven unit. And you know these engines just run and run and run. If you take care of them, your expectation on something like this is that it's a 10 or 15 year proposition oh, wow. all day. And you can either mulch or you can bag. It, they're great. And as I mentioned, around $450 for something like this. And within the Toro line, you can find all kinds of different kinds of things. Four wheel drive and pace. They have all these add-ons. You know, it's like buying a car. Yeah. They have, yeah. And, and when you do that, it gets more expensive. Um, the other thing is Toro also makes battery operated. I didn't bring that today, but I'm going to show you a different one there. So I like these but they're gas powered. Yeah. And for the vast majority of us, we're not cutting the lawn for more than 45 minutes or so, unless you live, well, unless you're Larry. I guess Lisa would need a bigger one because they've got that state. whole like <laughs> acres, right? right? Okay. And Larry wears the shorty shorts when he's out there mowing. <laughs> well, you gotta keep things why. You got those good looking legs. Yeah. Thank God he had that yeah. knee done. Yeah. Anyway, um, so this is the Ego. Now this unit, battery operated. Now this is what's beautiful about this. This battery will, in this mower, will run for 45 minutes. Okay. And then this battery, which is 56 volts, works in all their other products that they sell. So oh. a leaf blower, a trimmer, you name it. This battery goes, in, it's heavy. This is where all the money is. This thing is 600 bucks. It is self-propelled. It has lights on the front, so you oh, can, you know, and if you're, you know, you get home late from work and you gotta cut the grass. Yeah. But here's the beauty. 45 minutes runtime, no gas, no oil, no tune-ups. You just plug it in and go. And if you buy multiple batteries, let's say you've got a larger yard, mm -hmm. you buy a second battery, you can go 45 minutes, then the battery runs out, you pop it out. It it's like a cordless tool. And it has all these other features. This one will mulch, you can adjust the height. It has bagging capabilities. The handle adjusts up and down. For my money, if you're gonna buy a lawnmower and you don't have a ginormous yard, mm -hmm. this battery is the way to go because okay. you can store it, flip it up, it doesn't have to worry about anything spilling, and they make snow throwers, all the implements you would need. And again, Ego does that, and Toro does as well, both very good brands, and if you're gonna ask me between gas and electric, I say electric. Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> Judgment's been made. Judgment <laughs> made. <laughs> Listen to Lou's Outsports Radio Show on WGN Radio on Saturdays from 6 to 10 a.m. And subscribe to his YouTube channel for videos on how to maintain your home. Lou, thank you very much. See ya. Good to see you.